Hi, readers and writers and thinkers and problem solvers and future leaders of America. It's Mrs. Holbrook and Baby Echo here today to start out a new unit. So that means we have some new things to learn to help us become better at everything with reading and writing. But first, our warm up. We're going to keep doing these standard, these big ones with the digraphs until you know them in your sleep. TH, thumb. When Baby Echo looks at you, repeat it loud and proud. WH, whistle, w. CK, sock, k. SH, ship, sh. CH, chin, ch. And for our standard cards, A, apple, a. Ah. B, b. E, ed, a. Uh. I, itch, i. Uh. O, octopus, a. Ah. P, p. U, up, a. Uh. V, v. Add in the trick words we've done so far. Try to beat me. Or for two into we, he, she, be, me, and as has the a uh, of okay very nice job especially if you beat me some of those times you're a fast reader out there you will ready for something new now okay i am going to build a word Okay, take a look at this word. Let's tap it together. M is miss. So this word has three sounds, but you know what? It needs another S. Dun, dun, dun. See that? Even though there's two S's, it's only one sound. It goes m i s. That would be just one tap. M i s. This happens when an S comes right after a short vowel to end the word. And we have to double it when that happens. Let me show you with a few other words. What's this word say? K is kiss. Yeah, the S comes after the short vowel, so we double it. We have to do two S's. Let me show you another one. Read me this word. Fuss. You don't need to fuss. Look, it's easy. Actually, I shouldn't say it's easy. Some things are easy for some people, not for others. But it is simple. It's a simple rule. If the S ends the word right after a short vowel, we double it. We put another S. Now, there are two words that do not follow this rule. And they're really common words. They're words that you see a lot. So I want you to know, yes is one of them. Yes has an S right after a short vowel, but we don't double it. 
Here's another one that does not get doubled. Bus. Neither of these get that second S. We call it a bonus S, a bonus letter. These are exceptions, but almost all the other words do get it. <clears throat> all right, let's spell away fuss. And I'm going to show you something with another letter. So words like S, words that end in S, that's not the only letter. There's two other letters that need to get bonus letters if they're at the end of the word. And they're right here. F, L, and S. We did S. Let me show you an example of L. Like the word well. I hope you get well. If an L ends a word right after a short vowel, we need to put another L. L is a bonus letter just like S. And it's still just three taps. What L? Well. Just three sounds. Let me show you how S is also a bonus letter. Okay, can everybody show me a muscle? Are you strong? We say that you're buff. I'm gonna build the word buff. Buff. Uh. Okay, here we go again. F ends the word right after a short vowel. So we need to double it. We need to make it buff. Okay. And there's a special way that we mark these bonus letters. When we put the extra one, the bonus up, that's the bonus one, we put a star over it because it doesn't make another sound. It's just there because that's the way it needs to look. So to show that it's just a bonus, we just write a star right above it like that. And I know sometimes it's hard to draw stars, so sometimes kids just kind of do that kind of star. Either one is fine. So we need to add this to your notebook so that you can have a place to look to help you remember the rule. So I would like everyone to go ahead and grab your student notebook. And we're going to put it in the spelling rules. So those are kind of towards the beginning. Spelling rules, bonus letter rule. I, and in my book, it's on page 20. It looks like this. It says, the bonus letter rule for F, L, S. Oh, and sometimes Z. Sometimes it happens with Z, but not always. So it tells you the rule right here. Pause if you need more time to get your notebook. It says, at the end of a one-syllable word, if the word ends in one vowel, followed by an F, L, or S, you double that consonant. And we're going to write down some examples. So under the F, F, let's write the word cuff. The cuff is like the bottom of a sleeve, a cuff. And let's put a star right over that bonus F. And now let's go over to the L's and let's add a word that ends in L's like tell, t, L. And let's put a star over that bonus L. And last, let's add the word miss. Miss. Mm. with that star as well. Okay, pause here if you need to finish getting these down. Okay, we're gonna add it to another spot in our notebook. We're also gonna put the word miss in our vocabulary section. So go to vocabulary and find the letter M, like we did the word much. So after that one, for me, it's on page 48. And let's write the word miss at the top and put the mark it put the star 
and then I'll tell you your sentence. Yes, do not miss the bus. That's our sentence. Do not miss the bus. Now the reason we're doing this sentence is because it's got the two words that are exceptions. Yes and bus are not doubled, but miss is doubled. So this sentence is going to help you remember that those are the ex exceptions. Yes, do not miss the bus. Okay, pause here until you finish that entry. My period wasn't very dark. Okay, you may put these away and you need to get out your Velcro board, your letter board. And the first thing that we're going to do is add the bonus letters to our boards. So in your little baggie that you got from your teacher, you have letters that we haven't taught you yet. I would like you to find the three bonus letters. So you'll have an extra F, L, and S, and you'll put them under the digraph on your board. This is where they'll live. So please pause and take a moment until you add these bonus letters here. Okay, if you're back, you're ready to find some sounds. Let's do just a few sounds. Repeat after me. Y. Point and tell me the letter that says Y. Y. J. Point and tell me the letter that says J. J. One more. Ch. Point and tell me the letters that say Ch. CH. Okay, get ready to build a word. Repeat after me. Fill. Tap it with me. F I O. Three taps. Think about how many letters. Okay, go ahead and build your word fill. I O. And when you're done, you can check it with mine. Okay, let's spell it away. F I L bonus L. I hope you all remembered that bonus L. Okay, let's do another one. Bill. Repeat after me. Bill. Let's tap it. B I O. And let's build it. Let's spell it out loud first, actually. B I L. Here we go. Do it on your board as best you can. When you finish, check it to mine. And let's spell it away. Put them back in the right spots as you spell it. B I L bonus L. Okay, what do you say, readers? One more word today. The word is toss, like I'm going to toss you a ball. Tap it out. T -a -s. Spell it with me. T O S. Build it. Okay, check it with me. How did you do? Did you remember your bonus S? Good for you. And let's spell it away. T O S bonus S. And before you're done, please make sure your board looks neat and all the letters are in the right spot. And then you can clean up and I'll see you next time. Great job.